I'm Patrick Lyons with DNVR, and here's the deal with the Rule 5 Draft. Not to be confused with the Rule 4 Draft, held each June to select the best amateur players from college and high school. The Rule 5 Draft allows teams to pluck certain underrated prospects from other clubs on the final day of the winter meetings. Its origins date back to 1903 and was created to prevent teams from stockpiling prospects. It also gives those players trapped in the minors an opportunity to play in the majors. The most famous Rule 5 pick of all time was Hall of Famer Roberto Clemente, taken from the Brooklyn Dodgers. Two-time Cy Young Award winner Johan Santana, as well as All-Stars Josh Hamilton and Odubel Herrera have recently been taken. Not every club will make a selection, as it's much harder to find a diamond in the rough these days, but those taken are immediately placed on their new club's 25-man roster and need to stay on the roster for the entirety of the season or else get sent back to the original club. So which players are eligible? Basically, only players not on the 40-man roster can be poached. If a player was signed at age 18 or younger and hasn't been placed on the 40-man roster in five years, he's eligible to be selected. If signed at 19 or older, with at least four years of pro experience, you might be a Rule 5 draft pick. I don't see the resemblance. But Patrick, I see a loophole. Let's close it. A Rule 5 draftee cannot be stashed on the injured list for the whole season. Rather, he must be active for a minimum of 90 days to avoid going back to his previous team. So can these picks get traded? Absolutely. Clubs may trade a player selected in the Rule 5 draft, but the same restrictions apply to the player's new organization. The team might also work out a trade with the Rule 5 pick's original club to acquire his full rights, thereby allowing him to be optioned to the minors under traditional circumstances. Clear as mud? Well, this might help. The Colorado Rockies have loved trading their Rule 5 pick in recent years. In 2015, Colorado snatched 22-year-old Luis Perdomo from the St. Louis Cardinals and immediately traded him to San Diego for some cash. Three seasons later, Perdomo threw a pitch behind Nolan Arenado and, well, it's probably best they never became teammates. In 2014, they drafted and traded first baseman Mark Hanna to the Oakland Athletics, who was worth 4.5 war in 2019. The previous year, relief pitcher Tommy Conley became the only Rule 5 pick in Rockies' 27-year franchise history to make the team out of spring training. Colorado has also had their system rated by other clubs. Speedy shortstop Everth Cabrera was taken by the Padres and became an all-star four years later. The first player ever taken from the organization was Jeff Houston, a 33-year-old infielder at that point in his career. The University of Wyoming Hall of Famer would later come back into the fold as a broadcaster with AT&T Sportsnet. But the most notable player ever yanked from out the Rockies system was Seattle Seahawks quarterback Russell Wilson. No, seriously. Before transferring to Wisconsin, Wilson was a second baseman with NC State, and Colorado selected him in the fourth round of the 2010 Rule 4 draft. He lasted all of 93 games as a professional baseball player over parts of two seasons before being taken by the Texas Rangers for funsies and didn't play a single game with them. The Yankees traded for his rights in 2018 and let him have one at bat during a spring training game because why not? It's likely Wilson had zero regrets about choosing football as a sport du jour. He never won a Super Bowl, did he?